Welcome back to the channel, guys. It is me, 80 Summer 44. So today, guys, we're going to talk to you guys about Barcelona versus Cadiz in La Liga, guys. This is a huge, huge game for Barcelona, guys. And guys, I may do a separate video later tonight or even tomorrow. I don't know. I'll try to do it before the second leg about what Xavi specifically should do for the second leg and how he should prepare for his team. Because what he did against Manchester United the first leg was a disgrace. But I don't really want to discuss too much about that. I'll rather save that for a different video. So expect a video, maybe if I'm going to do a video again, I'm probably expect it on Monday, potentially even Tuesday. Okay, so let's go ahead and look at the squad list. We're also going to look at the insights coming into this game. So Ter Stegen obviously is going to be in the goal, right? Sergio Busquets is be, be, he's back from injury, which is great. Gabi is back uh, there as well. Lewandowski, Ansu Fati, Ferran Torres, and Yaki Pena, Christian Sandmark, Alonso, Jordi Alba, Kessi, Roberto, Frankie De Jong, Rafinha, Kunde, Eric Garcia. Alejandro Balde, Pablo Torre, Arnaud Tines, and Alacron. Pretty much the same squad list except for two big omissions. Araujo is not in there because he is suspended due to yellow card accumulation. And, obviously, Busquets is back from injury. Okay? So, you look at the squad, that list that um, Barcelona is expected to play against Cadiz. This is the 11 that we expect to see. And we're going to also look at the insights coming into this game after uh, we look at the lineup. So, as you guys can see, Ter is going to start. Now, I think the question for Xavi is this. Is, is he going to rotate for this game? Because I wouldn't be surprised, you know. And he may use the likes of Alonso. Or he may not use Alonso. Because my thing is that I think he's going to either use Alonso this game or the United game. And I have a stinky feeling he's going to use Alonso against United. So I don't think Alonso will play this game. Alejandro Balde surely should play a left back. Because Jordi Alba is going to probably be our first choice left back in Europe. So... At the center backs, Christensen, he, he should start this game. Obviously, Garcia is going to start with Noah Rajo. And um, obviously, Kunde will be rested. Roberto at right back. And then the midfield, man. We're going to see a midfield of Gavi, De Jong, and Kessie. Potentially, Busquets can slot in. Potentially for Gavi, because obviously, Gavi's not going to be playing against Man United on Thursday. So, we could maybe see Javi do that. Although, I still expect to see Gavi start, just because of the fact that he's a very, very important player for us. And then Lewandowski in the middle. Rafinha on the right. And then Fati at the left wing, or maybe even see Ferran Torres. So this could be a big opportunity for Ansu Fati because obviously, with the whole Gavi suspension thing, he's in a good position to replace him. And as you guys can see right here, guys, looking at Cadiz players, man, I'm looking at Guardiola as a big player. Ledesma is a good player. Uh, these are really important players for them, and they also have a player there that suspended Alfonso Espino. The suspended. And look at how many injuries they have. A lot of injuries. Obviously for Barcelona, Pedri's out. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention that Pedri's out. He's gonna be out for a month. And Dembele is also out. And obviously, Busquets is back, so this sh should be updated. Head-to-head um, -head record, Barcelona's got one win, two draws, and two wins for Cadiz. Uh, the last time we played against them was a 4-0 win against Cadiz at September 10th. Cadiz won 1-0, the reverse fixture. Well, Cadiz won 1-0, then 0-0, 1-1, then 2-1. So let's go actually look at Let's actually look at the insights coming into this game. And then we're going to give you guys a score prediction. Uh, oh, click the wrong thing. Here we go. Barcelona Cadiz. This is the game. This is what I was talking about. Sorry, I clicked the wrong thing. So Barcelona's expected to win is 81%, draws 13%. Cadiz is 6%. You guys can see Cadiz is battling relegation 16th place, man. Timeline. After registering six consecutive wins with Cadiz in La Liga between 1991 and 2006, Barcelona was just one, one of the last five means in Cadiz in the competition. Draw two, lost two. The most recent, of which came in September 2022. Barcelona just lost one of their last four to 14 La Liga home matches against Cadiz, but their defeat came at Cadiz in the most recent... League visit to the camp now. It was the first time Cadiz had kept a clean sheet. Alex Al Grunas saw in the top flight of the game. Barcelona had lost have any of the last 12 La Liga games, winning the most recent six. If they beat Cadiz, would equal their best winning streak under Xavi Hernandez in the competition. Won seven twice February, April, and August October 2022. Cadiz have lost their last two away games and have now lost three and one in the competition since April 2006 with Victor Esparago as coach. Only Athletic have more, had more high turnovers than Barcelona in La Liga season when Cadiz have made the fewest high turnovers of any side in the competition, 102. Yeah, guys, I mean, you guys can see the stats are very much in Barcelona's favor, and Barcelona should be winning this game, and that's what, um, you know, it's going to be very, very important. Because, like I said, guys, if Barcelona do not beat Cadiz, it's going to look really bad. It's going to look really, really bad, and um, it's going to be very, very sad indeed. So, my score prediction for this game, guys, my score prediction, I am going to go for Barcelona to win this game. Two goals to nil against Cadiz in La Liga. I want you guys to comment up below your score predictions. My goal scores of the day. I think Lewandowski will get back on the scoring sheet. And I have a feeling Rafinha is going to score. Rafinha has been a really, really good form in Barcelona. And I think he'll continue on his hot scoring streak. 
against Cadiz. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video, guys. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Remember, guys, if you're new on here, considering that subscribe button, hit this like button as well if you did enjoy. Also, comment down for your thoughts. Anything else I forgot to mention. Remember, guys, to share this video with your friends, become a member of the channel by clicking on the join button. And yeah, I think that's all for me, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy. And I'll see you guys later. Peace out.